Hey everyone, this is Redhead Goes Healthy and welcome to week four of Mindful Mondays. So we are on chapter four of James Clear's Atomic Habits. Uh, this chapter was very short, but I thought it packed a punch. This is where he introduces us to what he calls the first law, make it obvious. So the main point of this chapter is to talk about habit formation, and particularly those habits that just eventually become invisible to us. So over time, the cues that spark our habits become invisible, which simply means that we no longer notice them or we think about them as things that we're actually doing. They become automatic. So the key in this chapter, the invitation in this chapter is to start noticing our habits. This chapter is more of an opportunity to do an exercise. So it's gonna be pretty short in terms of a YouTube video, but I will say that I downloaded this habit scorecard where you make a list of all your daily habits. So like as simple as wake up, brush your teeth, whatever you actually are doing right now in your daily routine, he says, make a list of all of those things. And then next to each habit, put a positive sign if it's something that's actually leading you toward the identity that you wish to become. Put a negative sign if it's taking away from that identity. And then you can also just put an equal sign and that'll just be a neutral activity, like waking up would be an equal sign. So I'm gonna show you guys what I have done. And then if you wanna download the same sheet that I have downloaded, it's free. So this is in the book and I'm gonna put the link maybe in my description down below. Figure why would I put a link there? You can't click this video, but I'll put a link to the scorecard down below. And if you wanna do it, I highly recommend it. It was pretty cool. All right, so here is the scorecard. I put it into my Remarkable, which is why it looks like a digital uh, platform. But basically what you do is I just said, okay, morning routine, because I actually realized I, I do a lot of things and it does not fit on his scorecard. So wake up, positive, check phone, uh, negative for me. Uh, use the bathroom, positive, obviously, make some coffee, that's positive, go back to the bedroom. I said that was neutral. Like I usually will turn on my coffee pot, go back into the bedroom, then I'll check my phone again, negative. Then I'll drink my coffee, positive, check my email. I'm gonna say that's negative because guys, that's not the first thing that I wanna do in the morning, it's not necessary. So I'm working on changing this. It's gonna take me some time, I'm a bit of a workaholic. Then we've got the bathroom, brush teeth, positive, workout. I, this has become a habit. You guys have been following my channel long enough to know that like I have actually made this a habit. Now it's not invisible yet. I always notice when I'm working out. I don't know if the goal is for it to become invisible, um, but yeah, it's definitely a major positive in my life. Shower, positive, make lunch, positive. Uh, I usually will listen to a podcast while I'm getting ready. And so that is a positive. And then the damn email again. So <laughs> I still said negative. I want to get to a point where I check my email when I'm at work, not at home. So that's why it's negative for me. So that's it. I'm excited to see where this takes us. I like when we're just sort of like writing down things that are pretty obvious to us. Obviously, I think we're going to try to do more of the positive things and less of the negative things. But until the next chapter, I'll see you guys next time.